You know, we've brought you stories of volunteer groups from really all across East Tennessee, some going to areas impacted by Hurricane Dorian, others, though, remaining on standby to help out. And tonight, another group is preparing to head out with supplies. Their destination, the Bahamas. Yeah, we're talking about remote area medical. They are partnering with Air Mobile Ministries to bring a tool that they say will help thousands get access to clean water in areas devastated by the storm where water is contaminated and really unsafe to drink. WAT 6 on your side reporter Madison Keevy joining us now here in the studio in Madison. We're told this tool is really changing the game, if you will. So what does it do? Yeah, so we're talking about a water purifier, but this isn't one that you might have in your fridge at home or even something that you could get access to, so to speak. This machine has the technology to turn water potentially contaminated with disease into water that's safe to drink, and it all happens within just a few seconds. It was created 15 years ago, and when Remote Area Medical's founder, Stan Brock, learned what it did, he knew this was a partnership in the making, bringing fresh water in a machine that you can carry. So you put the little buttons here, and there it is. Consider this a water treatment plant. In a case that's small enough to go into the overhead bin of a commercial airliner, this is a 1,000 people a day in this one machine. Joe Hurston helped create the Air Mobile Rescuer. You're pumping clean water from the dirty water. You don't have to fly millions of pounds of water in, and you give people water, then they can devote all of those assets to medical and evacs instead of flying in times millions of pounds of water bottles. It comes with everything it needs to run for years. The setup only takes 60 seconds. The light, part of the purification system. That knocks down the particles, then it goes through ozone and UV that kills the bacteria and the viruses. This trip to the Bahamas to help in the wake of Hurricane Dorian, a partnership with Remote Area Medical. When you think about how many tons of water it would take to fly down an aircraft or on ship. Whereas you take these units down, you can set them up, they operate on a motorcycle battery, solar. Air Mobile Ministries and RAM collaborate on missions all over the world, like this one, taking 20 machines. That's clean water for 20,000 people a day. That's 3.2 million pounds of water that we're carrying in that one little airplane. That's David slaying Goliath. <laughs> That's right, and they're all ready to go. They take off from Knoxville tomorrow morning, very first thing at 6 a.m., though Joe tells me he'll be at the airport at 4.30 tomorrow morning, making sure everything is ready to get to their final destination of the Bahamas. Kristen. Wow, Madison, it's incredible to think about it how is that much that will help. A thousand people, yeah. that one case. That one case, so they 20,000 yep. with all of them. Mm. All right.